Hello friends, welcome back to our tutorial designing an impressive architectural building in Revit 2018 Metro. If you have been following along, go and open the file 00 underscore 022 underscore BIAB underscore N. You can also download this file on the website. Go to the, double click the roof one view to open this view. Zoom in into this area. Right click the reference plane and select grid similar. Draw a reference plan from this point to this point. Click the pick line button in the draw panel and change the offset to 750 millimeter. Offset this the edge of this roof down. Right click the reference plan again, grid similar. Draw another reference plan from this point to this point. Go to the quick access toolbar and select the align dimension command. Select the face of this wall and the face of this wall and select the reference plane. Move the mouse cursor down and click in an empty area to place the dimension. Click the EQ button to equal constraint the reference plane. Click the modify button. Select the dimension. In the property palette, change the equal display by clicking the down arrow and select value. The value is, the value is 1500 millimeter. Select the dimension command again and select the face of this wall and click this reference plane. Click to place the dimension. Click the modify button. Select the reference plane and change this value to 1500 millimeter. This value must be equal with this value. Now, right click the roof and select grid similar. Make sure that the base level is set to roof 1 and go to the draw panel and select the circumscribe polygon command change the side to 8 and move the mouse cursor click at the center of this reference plane and move the mouse cursor down and snap to this reference plane click the modify button hover the mouse cursor to one of these case line and press the tab key click to select all of this sketch line change this value to 9 move the cursor away from the from the property palette, click the green check mark. Go to the default 3D view to see the result. Hold down the shift key and your middle mouse button to orbit around. Now select this roof and click edit footprint. Go to the roof 1, select the pick line command and uncheck define loop. Click the ridge of this other roof and this roof. Click the trim extend to corner. Select this sketch line, this sketch line this sketch line this sketch line click the modify button select this sketch line and hit delete on your keyboard click the green check mark go to the default 3d view to see the result now select this roof and click edit footprint go to the roof one view click the line command in the draw panel start a line from this point and draw this line to 45 degree start a line from the in to the intersection of this sketch line and the ridge of this roof and snap to an angle of 22.5 degree click to end the line segment press escape select the trim extend to corner click this sketch line and this sketch line click the modify button select the trim extend to single element and pick the this roof extend this sketch line select the line command in the draw panel and start a line to the intersection of this sketch line and the ridge of this roof move the mouse cursor to the right make sure that the sketch line is horizontal and snap to this ridge of this other roof select the trim extend to corner select this sketch line and this sketch line click the modify button now select this sketch line go to the modify panel and select the mirror select the mirror pick axis Pick the center of this roof to mirror this line to the opposite side. Go to the draw panel and select the pick line command. Click the edge of this roof. Click the modify button. Now select this sketch line. Hold down the control key and select this sketch line. Hit delete on your keyboard. Select the trim extend to corner. Select this sketch line and this sketch line. Click the green check mark and go to the default 3D view to see the result. Now select this roof, this small roof and click edit footprint go to the project browser and double click the roof one view to open it select the draw line in the draw panel start a line from this corner and draw the line to the center of this roof select the pick line 
command and pick the edge of this roof. Select this sketch line and hit delete. Select this two sketch line. Make sure that the, def the defined slope is unchecked. Clean the green check mark to see the result. Go to the de default 3D view and see the result so far. We are almost at the end, but if you look at the roof, the roof is goes. This roof go under this big roof. If I select this these two roof and click the sun classes in the view display bar and select isolate elements, click. You see that this roof goes beyond this other roof. We're going to edit this roof in the next tutorial so that the two roof can meet at an, at a perfect geometry. Click the sunglasses and select Reset Temporal, Hide Isolate. Click the Zoom to Fit command. Go to the, click the File tab and hover the mouse cursor to save, up, save us. Click Project. Rename this file to 00 underscore 023 underscore DIAB underscore M and click the Save button. I'm going to end this video. In the next tutorial, I'm going to modify this roof to meet with the other roof in a perfect geometry. If you like this tutorial, please click the like button and share it to your friend. If you have any question or suggestion, please leave a comment below. If you want to continue this tutorial or any other tutorial on my channel, please subscribe. Thanks very much for watching. I hope to see you in the next class. Goodbye.